I'm here with Maya and I'm going to interview her and get all her thoughts about the Cabo Hill family pieces puzzle that we did today. But first we want to say thank you Cabo Hill. Thank you Cabo Hill for sending us four of the family pieces puzzles. So what did you think was really cool about these puzzles? What was different about them? There are three different sizes. One's large, one's medium, and one's small. Yes, exactly. So the pieces come in three different sizes, large, medium, and small. Okay, let's show them the different puzzles we got. So this one is called Winter Barnyard. And the next one is called Gingerbread Houses. And then we have Song for the Season. And the last one is Christmas Train. Okay, so which puzzle did we do, Maya? We did Winter Barnyard. Winter Barnyard. So tell me, what did you think of the puzzle pieces? I think that they're awesome. <laughs> what made them awesome? What did you like about them? I like the different sizes. Because, like, if you don't like doing a, that many small pieces, then you can do the bigger ones with bigger images, and they're kind of easier than the small ones. So that makes it really good to do these puzzles. Ari just crawled underneath our tripod. So because it has the different sizes, it makes it really fun to do with people in the family because the younger people can do the bigger pieces and the older people can do the smaller pieces. All right, why don't you show them examples of each of the different size pieces? Okay. So this is one of those bigger pieces and eh. this is a size comparison. This one's a small one and this one's a big one. And then this one is medium. What else did you think was cool about these puzzle pieces? I think they're cool because they are a lot of different shapes and it kind of like stumps you on the small ones because it's like that's so weird and it's like oh you got to turn it the other way and then it'll go in. Right. Okay so what we're going to do next is we're going to show you the favorite details on the puzzle. So this is the puzzle and I really like the horse because it's like a lot of big pieces and um, it kind of is hard because of the brown and then there's like little kitties and a pony and another cat and this cute little doggy and then a sheep and if you like like to do brown pieces but big then you can do this one but if you like brown pieces but small you can do this one and then there's also the doggy and this part was really hard and then this part was hard but um, we still did it and it's cool. Okay, so Maya, on this puzzle, which animal was your favorite? My favorite is the big brown and white horse. I like them, that one the most. And then what part was the easiest for you to do? Um, probably the bottom where it's like snowy with a little bit of hay. So Cabo Hill Pizzas, Maya, this is what's called a linen top. And when you have a puzzle that has a linen, oh. <laughs> when you have a puzzle that has a linen top, if you look at it, you can see there's a little bit of a pattern on it. Can you see that? Mm -hmm. How it's like crisscross. And what's nice about linen pieces is there's not a really strong glare. So Maya, let me get your final thoughts on the Cabo Hill family pieces puzzles. Do you think other families would like to do these types of puzzles? Definitely. They're super fun. Yeah, <laughs> they're super fun and I feel like a lot of people should get them because they're super fun. They're super fun. Super fun to do. You heard it here. They are super fun to do. 
Thanks for watching. Thanks. Bye. Bye.